Hello my soccer universe. Long time no see. Well, I also need a vacation. After the FCON final, I honestly I needed a good break. Um, it was a pretty intense one and a half months, I told you. And uh, first prepared my vacation and then I actually went on vacation. Where of course soccer doesn't let me really go, but it was good enough that I feel fully recharged. Um, I was where was I? I was in Bulgaria, where I picked up New Jersey, the Bulgaria 2016-17 home jersey, which I actually liked a lot. They sold it, I think, for 25 euros on sale. It's the original. I bought it directly from the uh, Bulgarian Football Union uh, store. Actually, my wife ordered it and got it. So thanks, honey. And yeah. Uh, I think it's great. We'll look at it uh, a little bit later. I wanted to have actually the current away jersey, the red one, but I didn't have it in my size. So yeah, I got this one, which is a nice consolation. Uh, the only thing is this I wouldn't want to have, but actually it makes it a nice overall looking jersey. So cannot complain. Absolutely at all. At all. Um, yeah, I have a little bit of catching up to do uh, before I show you the other New Jersey. Uh, first things first, um, we already have a round of the Premier League uh, played. I'm not going to do any previews for the European club season. I think you get this from other places uh, that are there, but I will probably review the Premier League first uh, match day, which is a little bit iffy because... I cannot at the moment watch the Premier League anymore because my streaming service, The Zone, doesn't show the Premier League anymore. So I have to see if I can find on YouTube or anywhere else highlights. If you have any reliable highlights, and I mean really just roughly five minutes per match at most, let me know in the comments below. I would be very, very grateful for that because I saw that the official uh, YouTube account for the Premier League, they don't show really highlights and I find this a big shame. The Serie A one? You can watch almost any game, so step it up Premier League. But uh, there are at least a few talk, but I'm sure I can get at least some information on the first round. At least we can comment on something. I don't expect it to be a long video, but sometimes say this and it becomes a long video. So you never know. Uh, also a little bit on transfers. I probably give you my thoughts on that, what I have um, on a right to work or home. Uh, the problem is that I don't have much time to make these videos, to be honest, because the biggest story for me, my team, Lusk, beat in the third qualification round for the Champions League, Basel, away from home 2-1, and tomorrow is the return match, probably today when you watch this, and I'll be at that match. So that basically, since I usually take my videos in the evening, that takes that out, maybe in the afternoon, I have to see how things are going. So, um... Well, it will be some time and then I will take another short vacation because we have a, a holiday coming up on Thursday. I will also prepare. I, I probably will make a short match report on that game because uh, this is the biggest thing in town. And just the thought of Lars going into the um, playoff is already great. And then they play Kiev or Brugge, which also doesn't seem too bad. Let's see. I'm also looking to get a Lusk shirt. I know they're changing the current one to have a little bit more traditional look still with pink sleeves, but yeah, uh, let's see. Maybe I can dust one off for cheap. I really hope. I want to get one of the current ones, although I really don't like them all that much. And then I want to do the jersey reviews. I will start with the Premier League as last time around and then I probably will do the Bundesliga because uh, Serie A and La Liga uh, will start a little bit later. Uh, there's also League, uh, which um, I had a lot of fun doing last year, but I have to say um, I see myself watching less and less Liga. It might change now that I can see the Premier League, so let's see. Um, I will try what I can see. I will first do the Premier League and then the Bundesliga. That's what I have uh, said for sure. And then we'll see how things go. Um, uh, don't expect the first video before uh, Saturday. 
I would say, um, probably more likely Sunday, but I'm planning to give you one video a day reviewing all the jerseys uh, that I at least released already. And then we have also for Champions League and so on. So it's going to be really interesting, I will uh, have to say. Looking forward to that. It is it is work, but I love to do it. So in between, I probably will make uh, today and tomorrow Mm, a few little videos that I can hold you over until the big uh, review starts. But let's get to the big theme of this video because I did not only get this wonderful Bulgaria jersey and look at the lion. This is what Bulgaria should have worn all, all around, not this crazy thing. I also love this nice uh, flag color here. And I don't, I don't even mind this gradient that's going on there. It really is nice. Uh, and before I open this, I have also two other jerseys that I saw that I'm really tempted by for very, very, very cheap. I think overall it will cost me probably not more than 15, 20 euros to get two real classics. Have to see if I can make it out to pick them up because I don't necessarily want to pay for shipping, but let's see. But let's go to the unpacking. Got this one from Zalando on sale, and this is not necessarily a new jersey, uh, but it is one that I really wanted to have, and it will be very interesting. I'll show you now. It is, of course, now the true Nigeria home jersey. This is the real deal from Nike. Zalando doesn't sell uh, cheap stuff, so I'm really interested in comparing this one here to my copy and I will probably edit this at the end of this video so I'm really curious to see. Let's open this and I think right off the bat I can already say that the stripes here are a little bit uh, tighter on this one but we'll have a look. I'll just open this back. Where's the opening here? This will be my first video comparing uh, original to um, uh, a replica. I shouldn't say an original because it's not the match jersey. Uh, to comparing a replica to a counterfeit jersey. Um, when I unpack this, here there is a lot more paper in there. <laughs> I can notice right off the bat. Um, a lot more paper. It has to be said. I can also note that the green in it, there's even paper inside. There's even paper inside to make this really stable. And I can also note that the green, I think, is a lot lighter. And I compare this to that. That's a whole, I mean, it's now with the light, it doesn't, but I'll show this in a way. And yeah, the if I look at everything, it's a lot more solidly made, I think. It's uh, no question that this is a better jersey. This tag did not come with the original, and I have the original tags. I'm looking now forward to see the tag for the Nigeria jersey. No, that, yes, so I, I see already a few comparison points. Um, let's Let's look at a few things and then we'll, uh, we'll compare the two jerseys. Just give me a sec, I'll pull down the other one, I'll make a quick cut and then we'll look at the differences between this one, the real deal and the counterfeit jersey, which still was a pretty decent quality, I have to say. Uh, it fooled me for quite, quite, quite a while, but now that I've seen the real thing, there is a clear difference there. Well. Talk to you soon. Hey, so uh, for the comparison, I just shot this comparison video and I thought it might be better if I split it in two. So for that reason, um, if you see now the New Jersey here and want me to see, compare it to this one, the counterfeit, um, I'll refer to the next video and yeah, let me know what you think about my plans. Uh, this New Jersey, that New Jersey and you know if you want to see the comparison just in the next video and I will see you there. <laughs> Bye for now. Hey there, 
I really hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, here are some videos and playlists that might be of interest to you too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel as it will give you all the updates on my channel, all things my soccer universe. And with that, I want to wish you a wonderful day. Thank you.